Hey guys, Steel the Gamer 24 here, and real quick before this episode, I am sorry that is uh, quite long. Uh, if you don't want to sit through it, just, I don't know, skip through or, you know, leave time marks, but um, I am really sorry that this episode is really long, mainly because uh, a lot of stuff did happen in this episode, so I, you know, couldn't really leave it out. Um, I hope to make this the next episode a quite shorter, so uh, I'll leave you guys to it, and hope you guys enjoy. Hey guys, Tilda Gamer 24 here, and welcome back to the adventures of Tyler Dragonblade. For my quest this evening, or today, or it's evening when I'm recording, uh, we will be going and getting Scarlet Screamers, or go defeat them, and get some Lumina Crystals so we're able to advance in the Triton Avenue quest. But, without further ado, let's get out of this little dormitory area, away from the bubbling kettle, and continue with our adventures. Let's go. Alright, I hope everyone that is watching this video is having a marvellous day, and uh, if not then, I don't know, maybe I can make you laugh or, or once or twice. Okay, let's head through. Um, actually, I think I'll advance in Renee Woofton's quest. Uh, I actually did one of her mission or one of her quests before. Uh, I just had to run around and click, or click, but I just have to activate three pegs so she can do upgrades, I guess, for uh, the main area. So well, let's see what she is uh, doing. Oh, hello. Please pardon our dust wizard. We're just doing a little routine campus maintenance. Speaking of which. Uh huh. I've heard enough about you to know that you're the type of person who gets things done, and I really need help getting things done. Okay, what do I need to do? The craftsmen I hired aren't exactly the most, uh, motivated bunch. They're all just sitting around waiting for supplies instead of working. Well, pay them. Could you take this fancy paintbrush to the painter by the headmaster's office, and this mortar to the masons near the Ravenwood Gate? Okay. Oh, and give these seeds to the landscaper over there while you're at it. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Okay. Alright. Uh, oh. I am pressing so many things. Uh, cancel that one. We'll do that one soon. But, let's... Go to the painter. Excuse me, Mr. Painter. I have a, I have a brush. Oi, what's all this then? Well, I'll be. This is a genuine unicorn hair paintbrush. Ooh. That was the most weirdest re reaction to a unicorn hair paintbrush, but... Okay. Um, are you going to put to good use, though? Suppose I should get back to painting, then. Give me thanks to Renee. Okay. Shoo shoo, go paint. Go on paint. Shoo shoo, go paint. Alright, uh, Ravenwood entrance. Mason, there we is. Okay. Mr. Mason! I has a, uh, a cannon. Yeah, what is it? Can't you see we're working here? Oh, you got the mortar we requested. Finally. We just been sitting here trying to look busy. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that, just coughing up. Yeah, well, I meant mortar, yes. Um, you've been sitting here looking busy. Mm. You're the boss, we should have the job done in no time. Now that we got the mortar, right then. Oi, let's get to work. For real this time. <laughs> get your bum back to work, boy. Alright, we're going to go to the landscaper. Excuse me, sir. I have a... Uh... I have seeds. Look, kid, I'll tell you the same thing I told all the others. I ain't got no seeds. And I wouldn't gift you any even if I did. Uh, what's that? Seeds? Oh, you got the seeds the boss wanted me to plant. Brilliant. I've got a lot of planting to do. Yeah, you do. The Get planting. The here is in desperate need of a resodding. What with all you kids traipsing about over the grass all day. You do have a point there, mate. We do, uh... We do run over the grass quite a bit, especially in overcrowded areas with people who have finished the game. Player? It was... Okay. Well, 
that's done. Let's go talk to Renee. Renee! Hey! Hello. Did you deliver all the supplies? Great. Thanks. Hopefully the craftsmen will work as hard at their jobs as they do at pretending to work. Yep. Hopefully they do. And if they don't, just come call me and I'll... I'll whoop them. Well, thanks again, friend. We'd never get this project finished without you. Be sure to come back and see the fruits of our labor soon. Okay. Oh, hello. You're that wizard everyone's always raving about, aren't you? I'm Renee. Nice to finally meet you. I'm glad you wandered by. You just... We just talked. How... Uh... What? Headmaster Ambrose tasked me to survey the commons to ensure everything is on the level. <laughs> and I could use a hand if you've got a minute. Okay. Could you take this range pole to a few different spots in the commons so I can record some measurements from this centralized location? I already did this. Hmm. Well, guess you, uh, all of you get to see what I did. Just place the range pole down for a second or two at the spots I've marked on your map, and I'll do the rest. Thanks. I appreciate it. Okay. Let's go do this. Alright, pole one was over here, if I'm not mistaken. Go over here, through here, under the waterfall. There's one! Okay, there's one. I saluted for some reason. Alright, pole... Ooh, pole two's this way. Excuse me, sir. Need to get behind you, I think. Where are you? Where is it? There it is. Alright, and pole three. Where was pole three again? Where is it? In here? Ah, there it is. Okay. Oh, actually, there was four. Forgot there was four. Let's get it out of there. Here it is. Alright. Back to Wolfton. Renee, I did it for you. Renee! Hello! You look especially boing. Alright, talk to Renee. Thanks! That's all the data I need. I should be doing more work here in the commons soon. Drop back by if you feel like helping out. Okay. Oh, by the way, maybe don't go around talking about how you helped me survey the commons. Don't want to start any silly rumors, you know. Great. Well then, I'd better get to work drawing up plans. Hopefully we'll talk again really soon. Bye-bye, and thanks again for your help. Okay. Huh. Quick tell everyone. Hey! Everyone. <gasps> Renee surveyed the town. Hang on, hang on. Uh, Renee did a survey of the commons. I spelled that wrong. Told everyone. Oh yeah, I turned off speech bubbles so you won't be able to see me saying it, but should should be able to see up here. Alright, uh no one's storm gate no. We're not doing that quest, we're doing Lumina Crystals. Okay, let's go. Lumina Crystals, yay! I really love the new loading screens for this. I'm actually happy that they've upgraded it. 
Oh, hang on a second. Just realised we got some more stuff. Hang on. Uh, got a new hat. Okay, that didn't. That nothing. Range pole. What does that give me? Nothing. Mm. Look at that, only two things that are new. Oh well. All my stuff's better. Alright. Okay, let's try and stay out of trouble with this one. I kinda don't want to go into a battle. Home free? You home free? Yes, we're home free. We're all good. Alright. Scarlet Screamers, prepare yourself. We shall defeat all of you. Yay. Oh, hang on. No. It wasn't just a Lumina Crystal. It was a charged Lumina Crystal. I'll get rid of that there. You know, constantly me saying... See, see me saying that. Stardust. Are there any Scarlet Screamers here? Nope. Hello? Wait, is there one back there? Oh, there was. Look at that. Oh, try and get this Scarlet Screamer up here. Give me the Scarlet Screamer. Thank you. Alright, we can do this. Um, let's protect myself. Ouch. Oh, it's not that bad. Alright. Okay. How much life? You have 235. Um, I guess hit you with a light spell. Hopefully get one of more powerful. One that is more powerful. If this works, that is one Scarlet Screamer down. One down. Did I get one? No. Okay, let's go to the side. Wait for another. Scarlet Screamer. Excuse me, madam, but I would like to fight. Excuse me. Madam. Ma You're kidding me, right? Yeah, she's bound to run into me, isn't she? There we go. That's the pain with this game, is you constantly have to run after your enemies. Okay, we'll get that out of the way. Two pips. Charge card. Oh, sick. Alright. I shall throw an Irishman at you. Oh, 
185. That shit mean you've got 50 hit points left. How about we throw a scarab at you? Let's go. Oh, a troll. Well, this is gonna hurt. One. Run. Quite a bit up. Come here. There we go. Uh, get that out of the way so we have two pips. Try and hit her for a full 200. Let's go with the scorpion. Alright, and 202. Awesome. That would mean if she has 83 health? Or 53 health? 33. Never mind. She has 233. Doi. Oh no, it's 235. Sorry. Oh well. Um. In that case, you can have a scarab beetle. Right, hopefully, we collect the lumina crystal from this one. Because I really don't want to. Uh, as I was going to say, I really don't want to spend most of this episode fighting Scarlet Screamers, but. Alright, come here. Fight me! Don't. Don't do this to me, game. It did this to me. Come here. Thank you. Alright. Fourth time. If you fizzle, I shall die. straight away. Wait for these to go past. Try and get this health orb. Mr. Health Orb, come here please. Thank you. Alright, let's sprint through, grab this one. And... Huh. I've noticed there's not as many enemies as there were quite a bit ago, well not quite a bit ago, but um, I think a couple of episodes when I first came to Triton Avenue. Hello, come here, thank you. If this doesn't fizzle then this might be Danjo. Oh my goodness. You are kidding me, I haven't gotten another Lumina Crystal yet. What's that? Uh, I can't do that. Sell that. Sell for two any nine. Alright. And that should give me enough time to run over here, grab this Scarlet Screamer, and battle them. Hey Ral. Okay, you didn't want to fight me. Okay. Six gold over that. Okay, come here. Fight me. No, fight! 
I need the Lumina Crystal. Thank you. Come on, I need that charged Lumina Crystal. Alright. Please give me a Lumina Crystal. I don't want to be fighting these Scarlet Screamers anymore. Yes! Alright, gotta go talk to Duncan Grimwater. Now I need you to gather some straw. I think I saw some field guards hiding out in the haunted cave. Go and collect some straw from them. Uh, okay, I'll do that later. Oh, sorry, no. There's cattail there, but I can grab that any time. Mouse is hovering over stuff it's not supposed to. Alright. Duncan. Here we go. You got the crystal from the Scarlet Screamers? Yep. Great! Now we can figure out what's going on here. And especially who is behind this. Okay, can I make a suggest uh, can I make a an estimate? It, it's probably I say estimate, but can I just guess? I'm I'm pretty sure you know the teacher of the death school is behind this and you're just against him. Duncan waves his wand over the Lumina Crystal and the Storm Medallion. Magical electricity arcs from the medallion, and an image appears in the crystal. Okay. Of course! Go tell Susie Griffinbane that the undead on Triton Avenue are being led by the Harvest Lord, and that he has captured her brother. Okay. Uh, Susie! Um, we found your brother. He's been captured by a guy harvesting a lot of stuff. Okay. My brother's been captured? Yeah. We have to save him! Duh. We have to. Oh no! I'll bet that when Arthur was scouting the haunted cave, the undead kidnapped him. He's probably at the Harvest Lord's Tower right now! Okay, where's the Harvest Lord's Tower? Please, if you defeat the Harvest Lord, You'll not only save my brother, but you may stop all of the haunting on the street. Okay. What's this say? Oh, wonderful wizard. Our mutual friend, Headmaster Ambrose, would have words with you if you have a moment to spare. Um. Okay. I'll mark that location. I'll be back. I want you to introduce yourself to Diego, the duel master. He manages the arena. Ah. The arena is just inside the entrance to Unicorn Way, on the right. Okay. Have you had a chance to visit the new pet pavilion in the commons? It's a wondrous place where pets can be trained, hatched, and can even race against their friends. Okay. It's quite easy to find. Just Head towards the library. Okay. I was wondering if you might do me the favor of delivering this parcel to Milo Barker, the ringmaster of the Pet Derby. Oh, have a care not to crush or drop it. <laughs> that wouldn't be at all pleasant. Headmaster Ambrose hands you a box with some air holes punched in the top. It makes a slight grunting noise when you shake it. Did you give me something illegal? Please convey this item to ringmaster Barker. Post haste. He shall reward you handsomely for your efforts. Okay. Logger do that. Okay, I'm actually confused now. Oh. Well, anyway, I need to go do that mission because I need to level up for going and defeating the Harvest Master. And these just opened up. Nice. Okay. Do, do, do. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Why, hello there, my fine young friend. Have you by any chance participated in the dynamic display that is the Wizard City Pet Pavilion? 
No. It's a captivating cavalcade of prodigious proportions. Near this very spot are fine vendors of pets and pet provender. That splendid structure over there is the hatchery. Okay. The Pet Derby offers all manner of enticing entertainments and delightful distractions for wizard and pet Okay, I'm just going to skip this. What's just that? Milo Barker oh, takes I the skipped package that. Merle asks you to deliver. He sniffs at it and shakes it. From inside the box comes an outraged muffled on. There's a piggy in there. I'd wager my reputation this is a pickle of some sort. I'm not sure what Merle thought we'd do with it. We're overstocked as it is. How about you keep this one? You're giving me a pig? You're giving me... a pig? And it's gonna hatch in a minute and 47 seconds. Awesome. How about in that time we go talk to Diego Sanchez, hmm? <sighs> Where my mouth cursor was, it looked like a male Ambrose had a ring. <laughs> okay, anyway. You went there, oh no, yes you were, never mind. Arrow! Greetings, my name is Diego Santiago Corriquez Ramirez III, champion duelist. Okay, I'll just call you Diego. The duel master bows with a great flourish of his cape. Okay. The arena is a wondrous place. Students come here to hone their skills with magic, practice against others, and gain endless glory and fame. What if I don't want to do that? To try your hand against your classmates, enter the arena and step into the duel circle. What if I don't want to do that? If you train well, perhaps you can develop skills to rival even the great Malister, yes? Near. What a duelist he was. He's the only person I would not want to duel in a real fight. Luckily, we only sparred for practice. Uh-huh. Oh, speaking of Malister, did you know that he and Cyrus are twin brothers? I wouldn't be surprised if Cyrus was helping Malister with all this maze in Wizard City. You should tell Ambrose to keep an eye on Cyrus. Okay. Yeah, um... How about no? Uh, first of all, let's let's go check my piggle. It's pink piggle. I, I want my I want, and I accidentally teleported. I have a pig piggy. You should be in Ambrose. You you should. You should be in the main area, not here. I'm here because I'm recording. You, you, shoot, shoot. Okay. Diego thinks that Cyrus is helping Malister cause all this trouble on Wizard City, eh? Oh, Diego shouldn't be spreading foolish rumors. Cyrus is a good professor. I trust him completely. Okay. I'm sure you heard that Malister Drake used to teach at the death school. He was once one of our best professors, very powerful and compassionate. He'd love discovering secrets of power. Okay. The only thing he loved more than power was his wife, Sylvia. May she rest in peace. If only she were still with us, things might be different. But even death cannot be undone. But it can be. That's the thing. Speaking of issues concerning Malister, one of his favorite students, a boy named Duncan Grimwater, has been tackling a ghost problem over on Triton Avenue. Uh -huh. Can you inquire as to whether he has heard anything from his old professor? We need to know if Malister has been contacting former students. Yeah, sure, Ambrose, I'll do that. Sure. Yeah, I'd rather not. <laughs> Alright, let's go...
Yeah, actually, let's go do that one. Oh, I'm such a doofus. Why am I walking? I can just teleport. Just. Ta da! Alright, let's go. Mr. Grimwater, hello. I need extra XP. So, the headmaster's still worried about Malister. If you ask me, I think Ambrose needs to quit blaming Malister every time something goes wrong in Wizard City. But he's the racer behind it? Malister Drake was such an inspiring professor. Most consider him to be the greatest necromancer of our time. He understood life's limitations and strove to face them unafraid. Okay, but what if he is behind it, though? Ambrose has suggested for me to stop practicing the death arts. He even suggested I give life a try. Ha! But I keep studying on my own. Maybe one day I will be as powerful as Malister. And let that curse follow you. If you want to find out more about Malister, maybe you should talk to an old friend of his wife. You have heard what happened to Malister's wife, right? Nope. No? Oh, if you're interested, go talk to Gloria Crendel in Old Town and ask her about Sylvia Drake. Those two women were close. She could tell you more. Okay. Again, rather not. Um... Alright. Let's go defeat this Harvest Lord. Let's go. Actually, what else I could do is... Yeah, no. I'm not going to defeat the Harvest Lord just yet. I am going to do that one. Yes. Oh, this isn't scary at all. Damn, well, the enter the cave and there's whispering everywhere. Field guard, that's what I need. Come here. Dark Sprite, let's do this. Okay, victory for now. Yes, got him. Yes! Exactly enough, and now I just need to run for that health orb. That's to my right. Let's go. Oh, please let me out. That was torture. Unless... Yes, we did it. Okay. Get out of the road. <laughs> oh, jeez. Why do they have to make things so hard? What is in that tree? Every time I go past it, Is it the trade in or something else? I oh, am no. so confused about something simple. Uh, gonna get that cat's tail. Fishes! Ah, you have returned with the straw we need! Yes, Excellent. I have. Yes. The last thing we need are some sticks for support. Okay. The best sticks to get are from the trees around Storm Drain Tower, at the end of the haunted cave. You should collect them from there. Okay. I'll start wrapping up the straw while you go and get the sticks. Okay. Then I can do two birds with one stone. Is this it? Yep. 
seems like this is it because there's branches everywhere. Is that all I need to collect? Red Mandrake. Is that what it is? Hang on, is there any chests? Pretty, yes. That's one. Okay, there's none there. Okay, okay. Let's enter this damn tower with nine seconds. This is a lot like World of Warcraft when you're going into a dungeon. Let's go. Probably gonna die. In the back of the room, you notice Archer, Susie's brother. Okay. So, wizard, you too have uncovered Malastair's plan. Too bad you will have to remain here with the other wizard. The both of you will be powerless to stop us. Complete honesty, I thought he'd have like a really dark and deep voice, like, So, wizard, you too have uncovered Malastair's plan. Too bad you will have to remain here with the other wizard. Both of you will be powerless to stop us. Soon the undead will drive out all the citizens and take over the rest of the city. And with the school in our hands, we will rule Wizard City. Ambrose will at last be <laughs> I, I really do think they should have gone with uh, my version, but... Yeah, the version I just produced just then, but... He sounds like a... Trumpet.
He is Thank now. Thank you for freeing me, my friend. I feared that no one was ever going to find me. Okay. Please, go and tell my sister that I am safe. I know I have worried her so. May the winds of chance bring us together once more, wizard. Okay, I will. Um, fill up my potions. Oh, that healed me. Full health, too. Nice. I didn't know I did that. Probably because I used it when I was very close to full health, anyway. Um, yeah, let's go all the way down to Triton Avenue. Actually, yeah. No, not Triton Avenue. Let's go all the way back to Susie Griffin Bay, but on the way through we'll deliver those branches to Blade... well, sorry, Blad. Uh, Blad Raven Eye. Very good work. These will work just fine. Now I'll get to finishing them up and ship them out immediately. Okay. Ta-da! I really do appreciate you helping me with these scarecrows, but something else has been bothering me lately. Okay. I'm worried about our mill foreman, Sir Homer Sunblade. I haven't seen him since the mill quit running and one of those ghosts made off with the keystone to the teleporter here. Okay. If you could, defeat haunted minions until you recover the keystone. Then we can go check on old Sir Homer. Okay. That seems fair. Alright, let's go talk to Susie. Then after Susie we're going to defeat minions. And I'm not talking about like Kevin, Bob, or Stuart. I'm talking about You saved Arthur haunted. from the Harvest Lord? Thank you, young wizard. I don't know what I would have done had I lost him. Okay, my name's Tyler, not Wizard. But, uh, okay. Sure. You'd better tell the headmaster what has happened here. He needs to be informed on what's happening in Wizard okay. City. Okay. Yep, I'll tell the wizard. I'll tell the headmaster right after I kill... Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. YouTube friendly. After I defeat... Uh, a lot of these minions. Alright, and then after this we get some health. Yes. No. Yes. No, give me the health. Thank you. Thank you. And that is how you defeat a haunt haunted minion. Get him with the thunder snake. Thunder snake. Zap zap. Did not collect key stone. Got it. Go deliver this keystone first. Where is it? Next page. You deliver the keystone first. Check on the guy. He'll most likely give me another mission. Sorry, I keep saying mission. I'm used to like Call of Duty and all that. He'll give me another quest. And uh, hopefully by then. I'll be able to Thank level you up. For getting the keystone. Okay. Glad fits the keystone into the teleporter. It begins to glow and hums to life. Okay, that's scary. The teleporter is fixed. I'm glad some things are going right around here. I don't want to go through Please that. Use the teleporter here to check on our mill foreman, Homer Sunblade. He's been missing since the mill shut down. All right, guess we're going through. Hi there, how you doing? I'm fine, you whippersnapper. But we have to get the store mill working again. Okay. This mill here is one of the main sources of magical energy for all of Wizard City. 
The undead sabotaged it. We have to get it running again, or we'll all be in serious trouble. Okay. Professor Bailstrom helped design the storm mill, so he might know how to fix it. You will need to go to Professor Bailstrom and ask his advice. Go quickly. Okay, no problem. Well, in that case, uh... Okay, stick that there. Teleport to the commons. Go talk to Ambrose. Then talk to... Bailstrom. <clears throat> You defeated the Harvest Lord? Oh, not many students can make that claim. Good work, young wizard. Okay. The Harvest Lord mentioned that he was helping Malastare. We need to find out what Malastare's plans are. If Wizard City is ever to return to the nice place it once was, it's hard to run a school with all the monsters running amok. Okay. Many thanks to you for straightening everything out on Triton Avenue, young wizard. I fear the worst is not over yet. Nah, it's not going to be. No more missions. Okay. We're good. Alright, let's go talk to Bellstrom. And that's extremely loud. Dire news indeed. If the mill is not restored, Triton Avenue will lose magical power and the rest of Wizard City will follow. Oh, we must act right away. Yep. Tell Sir Homer he can summon a crack using Lumina crystals. Then he can siphon its power back into the storm mill and get it working again. Okay, yep, we're not calling it an episode. We are not calling it the end of the episode. We are so doing this. I have been waiting for this fight for so long. Go talk to him. Uh, and I, I had a feeling that I need to go back to him too. So, alright, let's talk to Sunblade. He asked if I had some Lumina crystals. <laughs> By Gomer's beak, why didn't I think of that? He's a genius. Here, I'll activate his teleporter. Take all the Lumina crystals I have down to the arena. The Kraken will be drawn to them. Okay. Oh, I hope you're up for this. You'll have to defeat the Kraken if Triton is going to survive. I know you can do it. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, whoever is watching, I give to you the Kraken.
Yes! We got the him. The magic of the defeated crack flows into the air and up to the mill. Alright, we're good. Oh, we're good. Yes. That, and you can actually get a lot of items off of this guy as well. So, there's a bit of a tip for you if you try to, if you go to play. You defeated the Kraken and fixed the mill. Now Luminate Crystals will be produced again. The magic will flow I once more. Paralyzed. I hope you'll visit us again. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave a like, show me your support. If you want to know when I uh, upload some uh, videos, hit that subscribe button. And if you want to know when I upload exactly, hit that notification bell. As always, I'll see you in the next one.